guys, come on. The drama is real right now. The fights are fake, but damn you, Bobby. Damn it, Bobby. You gotta love it. Solo season presents the universe just for you, the season few. You gotta love it. Look at all this action. I mean, we're talking about a 45 minute match. I mean, jeez. Wow. Look at that kick, man. And here comes that karate chop. How did Wild Kyle not just die instantly from such an aggressive chop? That man's hands. Oh, man. Here are your winners, Sticky and Kyle Wildman Woodward. You gotta love it, man. You gotta love it. Those guys get all the respect in the world. But having taken such a toll on their bodies, how long can they keep up this kind of action? You've seen Buddha Bomb take a huge injury. And right now. Let's crack a beer. Let's get one rolled because we're halfway through the universe. And you know what that means. It's time to stay seasoned. Three punch combo because we know you saw the latest skit from Bryce Payne making a deal with the devil himself and Undertaker, the dead man. What could this possibly mean? What could this possibly mean? I'm at a loss for words. Standing sideline just like everyone else spectating this amazing drama. That's right. Hashtag the drama's real. Have you done it? Go ahead. Share it. Hashtag the drama's real. Once I click that link, once anyone clicks the link, we'll see it, man. No one else is out there doing that. Let's get it going. Solo season presents the universe. D nice. Bryce Payne. The new Bryce Payne. What will this mean? Making a deal with the devil and the Undertaker himself. I don't know which one of them's more scary. And if someone is willing to make a deal with both of them, that person is almost scarier. The recklessness, the absolute lust for power. Let's head to the ring and see what happens next. Making his D way nice. to the ring, the execution. from Ohio, weighing in at 265 pounds, D Crusher. That's right, D Crusher, D Nice, D Executioner, one of the largest competitors, talents in the universe, coming in tonight to absolutely rip apart anyone in his way. Here we go. No frills, no shrills, just a little bit of cheers. Action unleashed. There it is, man. That's one of the best, best competitors we have. You don't see a lot of them because just too damn threatening. Just too damn threatening. And tonight, taking on one of the most Crazy talents. Who challenges a guy like this? Oh! It can't be real. It can't be real. You hear the bells? No. This can't be real. He did. He made a deal. He made a deal with the devil. He made a deal with Undertaker. And his opponent. <laughs> From New York, weighing in at 220 pounds, Bryce Payne the Devil. I can't believe it. A whole new outfit. A whole new attitude. Bryce Payne the Devil. 
methodically making his way to the ring, absolutely frightening the chills. You want to talk about no chills, no frills. I'm absolutely chilled, and I'm absolutely shrill, frilled. Ah, what is that? Oh no, summoning what has to be some form. I can smell the sulfur. It's hot in here. What did he do? Oh no, this man is a demon. He's, he's the devil. Bryce Payne. Looking to put, looking to close some caskets here tonight and take a few souls with him. Back to the locker room. Will D. Nice, the execution, be his first victim. Tying up in the corner. Uh-oh. Oh, D. Nice disrespecting my man, Bryce Bay. And it looks like he's just going to go ahead and chain wrestle. He's going to lock it up and show his skill, and he does there. That's prime time wrestling. I can't believe it. You can see that everything's changed in this guy. No more camo, just... A few symbolisms of the universe. The long hair. The dark attitude. And the newly found strength. Holy cow. Lifting up D-Nice, a huge competitor. There's no way he should be able to lift up such a large competitor. You can tell whatever deal he struck with The Undertaker is working here tonight and a power he's carrying a 300 pound man this is insane oh he's absolutely going at the guy now Ooh, someone stop him I'm telling you just because he takes a few shots doesn't mean he's not going to come right back and he does, Bryce Payne. Almost a dead look in his eye. Oh. Now again, he's taking on someone that has destroyed competitors left and right. And look at him going insane. Going insane on my man, D-Nice, D-Executioner. Oh no, look in that, grabbing the beard. Oh, seriously, come on, ref. This guy, Bryce Payne, the devil himself. No doubt about it. What? This can't be, this can't be, no. D-Nice. The executioner finally. Uh oh, whoa, whoa, where's he going? Trying to take a little bit of a repeat here. He's right after him. Oh no, what a set. He's still. Oh, look at this. He's going to tell him to bring it out here. What? D Nice has figured out the. Oh my god, he's such a little cheater for that. Wow, D Nice almost afraid of the devil himself, Bryce Payne. Outside, this is a false count anywhere match hanging out here by the announcer table. I'm gonna have to have to stand. Hey, 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 you guys watch out. Hey, 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 whoa, whoa, there it is. That patented offense from D Nice. Looks like that referee's getting his uh, steps in today. No way, no way, D Nice absolutely using some treachery against the newest talent Bryce Payne you know for sure that that this is not done that was kind of low. I have never seen something so lowly in my life absolutely insane that was the most lowly thing I've ever seen here is your winner, D. Crusher. D. Crusher, D. Nice, 
D Executioner doing his job tonight. I don't uh did not quite expect that. I uh it it looks like you, that's what you get when you make a deal with the devil. I you know I don't think that this is over. I know for a fact this isn't over. D nice. D executioner. He used a bit of trickery there. He really did. He really used a bit of trickery to get over on the new talent, on the solo season's new talent, Bryce Payne. Now, a veteran like D-Nice and a rookie like Bryce Payne, even though he was given ultimate powers to lift someone that size, to do damage. Can you expect him to take that line down? What will he do next? You can only imagine with the powers of the underworld on his side. There will be hell to pay for such treachery. But right now, we're going to go ahead and uh, change the mood and get right back into doing what we do. Table match. That's right. So, the war is officially on, ladies and gentlemen. Every character, every talent gets three lives. You lose those lives, you're out. Every single person from your team has to be out, and you lose. Right now, the season few. Moondog, Rex, and Anthony Islander, a.k.a. the Hooligan. Challenging. The newcomers... The bullies, and they chose a table match. Can you believe it? Demon Suzuki and Farmer versus one of the most electrifying combinations known to man. Here we go. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 520 pounds, Farmer and Demon Suzuki, the bully. That's right. There they are. Farmer Demon Suzuki. You've only got to think with all the mystical things that have been going on lately with the solo season universe, will Demon Suzuki have something up his sleeve? The mystical man, Demon Suzuki and Farmer. The man's man. But right now. Oh, oh, spicy. Coming out separate this and time. Your opponents. First, from the fifth dimension, weighing in at 200. Now you've got to think maybe Moondog Rex is in the back still getting some uh, bandages, still getting worked on after his match earlier tonight. But Bomb definitely taking it to him. Uh, you know, you can only imagine what is going on in that back room right now. Anthony Islander definitely uh, giving the crowd what they want, though, regardless of his teammate being slightly injured from his match earlier tonight. Amazing. Amazing. Mike Campbell coming out. Distracting the solo season Universal Champion Mike Campbell. Distracting Jay Savage a few times earlier tonight. Gotta check that out. Like, share, subscribe, stay with the notifications, homie. That's how you know my videos drop. You gotta turn the notifications on right now. We've seen this earlier. And look, he has the jacket. There it is, he's obviously, oh man. You can see it in his eyes, the pain, the slow limp. He definitely is feeling that Buddha missile. You can tell he's feeling it, for sure. 
but carrying the weight of his team behind him, he has to step out here tonight and accept the challenge. 292 pounds, the dog. Now you've got to think. Choosing a table match, is it wise? Moondog Rex can throw a cow across the whole arena. So think what he could do to a talent of lesser weight. Anthony Islander, a.k.a. the Hooligan. One of the most physically gifted talents in the universe. Her karanas that are mean elbows that are slicing and drop kicks that are devastating. He can hit you from anywhere with anything, but it's gonna be meaner than me. Here we go, right in the center, we've got two teams. Who's gonna lose a life tonight? That's right, each of these competitors will lose a life if they lose tonight. Farmer, boom baby, big suplex. Talk about showing off the skill. Now we haven't seen much of these guys. We know Farmer won the subsequent TLC match, their first showing, and uh, right now, after watching their team captain, Bryce Payne, go through two competitors, Satan, the devil himself, and Undertaker. Maybe that was the cause. Maybe he hadn't quite recovered from those matches, those battles in hell, if you will. But you know, again, the bullies will not take it lying down. Oh, Moondog Rex. Understanding that he needs to create some space and rolls out the ring. Farmer and Anthony Islander. Whoa, I think it's about to be a fight. Oh, and he runs away. He runs away from Farmer. Oh, no. Huge right hand, chopping right hand. It looks like Farmer trying to use some of those Moondog Rex tactics, and it works. Jumping out of the ring. Oh, man, these guys have finally figured out how to use the uh, arena to their advantage after watching that huge Hell in the Cell match. Kyle throwing his competitors all around like a ragdoll. Now these guys are using the banisters as defensive positions almost. You've seen D-Nice uh, basically hide in a corner and from the devil himself, Bryce Payne, and win because of it. Talk about drawing a circle with salt. Demon Suzuki! Demon Suzuki hits a swanton off the rope. It was a springboard swanton. Are you serious? That should have ended the match right there, but he has to put him through a table. Does he even have the right repertoire to put someone oh man oh demon suzuki an untested character but right now doing double uh double reversals there using some good reversal oh no he broke farmer's oh no oh my god that's not good for anybody demon suzuki a definite demon there uh-oh, chest slap from the hoodie. And it looks like he's all alone. Demon Suzuki against two very rough talents. Oh, that's going to be the end of this match if he can pick him up. It looks like these two arguing over who's going to send him through, and that's going to be the end of it there. Oh, dodging a kick and throwing a chest slap, but he's not going to be able to duck Anthony for long. He does, though. He sees it coming and throws him into a table. Demon Suzuki looking to set up a serious win for his team, the Bullies. Farmer looking to grab a hold of a competitor, and he does. Oh, but Anthony. Islander, a.k.a. the Bully. Oh. I honestly can't believe it, guys. I honestly can't believe it. Someone has to... Oh, Demon Suzuki. He landed on the wrong side of the table. That's very damaging to your back. Those metal legs. Just not a flat surface to be landing on. Ouchie, wow, wow. 
Farmer from his knee throwing a huge elbow. Oh, Demon Suzuki's got to get in there. It looks like Farmer trying to hold off two competitors, and he can't. The rolling Sabat puts him leaning against the ropes. These guys, man, they need better teamwork. They keep hitting each other in these scuffles, in these scrambles, but can you blame them? Oh, man, another chest slap. It looks like these guys are getting ready for it. Mom Duke says Mom Spaghetti's already. I believe it's good. This is the last match of the night. Oh, Demon Suzuki with the double axe handle from almost two stories up. I can't handle the truth and neither can you. And I think it's going to be that the bullies are going to win. Or there it is. The commentator's curse. Oh man, comment 10. Moondog Rex looking to get people points tonight. Moondog Rex looking to get people some points tonight. Oh no. Someone better move that table. Someone better move that table. Oh man, speaking of moving tables. Oh, he didn't see it coming and he hit him with the edge of it. Oh no, the, the legs, no, the, the shins. Oh, he's gonna work it again. Oh God, Farmer, you gotta be careful. Oh, and he's standing on the table. I don't get these guys, they're so reckless right now. Oh, that's it, this is his chance. Oh, and he goes for a chest slap. Unbelievable, increíble. Oh, fuck, Farmer. That's it for you, buddy. Oh, the table didn't break. The table didn't break. Oh, right there on the unfolded table, on the, on the folded table there. That's still got to do some damage. Oh, no, he's lining it up. Oh, he doesn't see Demon Suzuki, and he throws a punch. No way, dude. That table must be made of some different kind of steel. Demon Suzuki! You see the here you hear the season few definitely giving some of their respect to these competitors tonight. Demon Suzuki throwing a amaze, throwing all caution to the wind there. All caution to the wind. Oh no, there's the setup. There's the setup. Moondog Rex looking right on though. He might be able to stop him. Farmer coming in. This is gonna how this is how it ends. Oh, Farmer being smart there. Oh, he's taunting him. Demon Suzuki taunting him. <gasps> oh, if that was a power bomb. Had he just dropped him forward, Demon Suzuki could have had it, but he doesn't have the strength. Oh, two against one. Moondog Rex taking it to Demon Suzuki, trying to... Oh, he's not gonna last much longer with Farmer standing right there. Oh no, Demon Suzuki not doing his job. He has to watch out for his teammate. Oh, Demon Suzuki putting a curse. Demon Suzuki putting a curse on him. Oh man, when it, there, here it comes. Farmer's lining a dude. Farmer's trying to tell Demon Suzuki. Oh no, and he's taunting. Oh no, oh no. He did, he put a curse on him. I knew it. Demon Suzuki putting a curse on. Oh my God, no effing way. I knew there was gonna be something mystical. Oh my. What just happened? Anthony Islander with an amazing Huracurana. Holy cow. Blown away by that action. Now let's talk about it. Demon Suzuki putting a curse on Moondog Rex. He put a curse on him, an infinite run curse. He was stuck in place. But I think Demon Suzuki also had to stay in place during that time. I don't know if you saw it. My man, Anthony Islander. 
That was an amazing hurricane. Can you believe it? Man. Man, oh man. Ladies and gentlemen, hit that three punch combo. Like, share, subscribe. Four punch combo. Hit the bell. That's right. Turn your notifications on, man. Make sure you know I drop an episode every day. Every day. So make sure you stay tuned, man, because you might be the Here next are your talent winners, to win the belt. The hooligan, Anthony, and the dog. That's right, the dog, Moon Dog Rex. Coming out of that curse after the win. Super talented. Look at that table in shambles over there, thanks to the uh, her Karana. Yeah, boy. You know what I'm going to tell you to do, so why haven't you done it? Three punch combo, man. That's how you stay seasoned. The faction war is well underway. Looks like uh, the bullies down two lives right now. One for Demon Suzuki and Farmer. Honestly, couldn't have seen that coming. Never in a million years. After Demon Suzuki puts the curse on Moondog Rex. That was amazing. After Mike Campbell comes out and tries to distract Jay Savage. That was amazing. You guys are amazing. You stay seasoned out there, man.